My soulmate, Ainsley Rebecca Rhodes. My everything. The woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. You embody kindness, compassion, intelligence, loyalty, and of course, tenacity. You bring out the best in me. I was never a believer of fate and fairy tales, but boy was I wrong when I met you. Our first conversation, within a half hour, I knew you were different. Our relationship started at the beginning of COVID, being in lockdown together. Our bond grew so strong. I promise to love you forever. Through all of life's challenges, peaks and valleys, I will always fight for you. I promise to be your shoulder to cry on and continue to bring you joy and laughter into your life, to support you emotionally and through all of life's endeavors together. But of course we wouldn't be here without the support of all of our friends and family. They've helped shape the people we are to get today and will always be in our corner. I found the woman of my dreams, Ainsley Rebecca Rhodes, I love you to the moon and back, forever and always by your side. I love you. Eli, you are my bright light in this world. With you, life just makes sense. You keep me focused and driven on this beautiful path that we have begun creating together. You motivate and inspire me to be the best person I can be for us and our future. You challenge me to think different and consider new perspectives. You love me unconditionally, more than I ever thought I could be loved. You see the best in others, even when they cannot see it in themselves. There is only one man like you in this world, and I am so honored to call you my best friend, my person, Sadie's dog dad, and now my husband. I promise to be your equal partner in life. I promise to celebrate your victories, big and small. I promise to make the small, everyday, mundane tasks fun. I promise to always be your assistant GM when it's fantasy football season and never let you trade Josh Allen ever again, especially to your brother Jake. <laughs> and although I cannot promise to play less Taylor Swift, I promise to only make you listen to the 10 minute version of All Too Well only once on any given car trip. I promise to raise our kids with the impeccable family values that both Lori and Jane have instilled in us. I promise to honor my new title as Mrs. Bogue with the same humble, kind, and selfless legacy that I grew up so fondly knowing in your mother. I promise to love our future children with every ounce of my being and teach them to be unapologetically themselves. I promise to prioritize our marriage and our family, even when life and work gets hectic. I promise to be your best friend who stands by your side and has your back no matter what curveballs life throws at us. Most importantly, I promise to make our home wherever we are together. I love you and I can't wait to grow up with you. Eli, do you take Ainsley Rebecca Rhodes to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. To have and to hold from this day forward, for better and for worse, for richer and for poor, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do you part. I do. Do you take James Elliot Bode the fifth to be your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer and for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to death do you part? I do.
Standing in a crowded room and I can't see your face Put your arms around me, tell me everything's okay In my mind I'm running around a cold and empty space Just put your arms Ainsley and Eli, we're very proud of what each of you has accomplished in your young lives. Never go to bed angry at each other. Always tell each other, I love you. And thirdly, maintain a sense of humor. We wish you very much happiness wherever your professional pursuits and your family plans may take you. Ainsley and Eli, we're proud of you. We love you and we'll be there with you through thick and thin till of course it's time for you two to take care of us. These two are part of a group of people that I hold so dear to me. And to watch those smiles and big eyes today was a blessing to say the least. I look forward to watching these two thrive together as they make big life decisions and small ones alike. If I had one piece of advice, it would be to always cherish the moments we are given as you never know the curveballs life might throw. friends with Ains is easy. She is perennially cheerful, outgoing and laugh-loving, warm and welcoming, and a first-rate hostess and entertainer, just like her wonderful parents. Eli is Ainsley's peace. He's kind and genuine, funny, clearly loves Ainsley deeply, and obviously cares about other people. Ainsley and Eli recognize that love is a choice. They chose each other today before their friends and family and God. And with their vows, Ainsley and Eli promised to keep choosing each other every day because that's what love is. Yeah.